Oh, oh, there he is. Oh my goodness. I can't believe this is actually working. What's happening? Guys, I grappled myself. This is the hardest Amazing Frog video I've ever recorded. Guys, this is really close. Which one's gonna grab it? Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome back to the Amazing Frog, guys. I got something really big plan for today. Guys, we're putting the Megalodon up against the Red Megalodon. I don't know why, we, why we've never done this before, but this was actually an idea from one of you guys. This was from GG Boy. So GG Boy, amazing idea. Guys, I love your ideas. So many of these videos come from your guys' ideas, so thank you so much, GG Boy. Hey guys, keep the ideas coming for other stuff you wanna see. But guys, as you can see, I'm wearing the red shark head. Okay, you know what we should do? I wanna try to beat the car smash record. We tried this last time, it didn't work out so well. Let's try it again. But yeah, I'm wearing the red shark head. And yeah, if you wanna see how that all went down, check out last video if you missed it. But guys, I am so excited for today. We're gonna be putting up the Megalodon up against the red Megalodon. And put in the comments which one you think is gonna win, which one is your favorite, because guys, okay, here's my thought. Here's my thought. Don't let me sway you or anything. I think the original Megalodon is gonna win this. Like, he's the original, you know? So, I think he's gonna win it, but hey, maybe I'm wrong. You guys put in the comments who you think is gonna win. Guys, we're off to a really good start. Um, also, another thing I wanna <laughs> another thing I wanna do today, I know we've already put the RC car in the toilet before, but maybe some of you guys have missed it, but I wanted to drive it into the toilet. You know, I thought it'd just be fun to just drive, <laughs> drive the RC car into the toilet, and I don't know, maybe we'll put something else in there. We'll see. I know there's still some stuff we haven't put in this toilet yet, Okay, guys, this is going really well so far. It's kind of taking a while. It's taking a little while because the balloons, but dude, better safe than sorry, right? Okay, this is going really well. Okay, watch out for that frog. That, <laughs> he's probably gonna get blown away or almost, dude if, that, dude, if that tire hits him, he's gonna be on fire. Okay, it, whoa, that blew me up a lot higher than I thought. Oh no, that car's on fire. Dude, we gotta get down there quick. Hurry, yes. Wow, okay, that launched me. Guys, we're still on a roll. Maybe this is gonna be the whole, <laughs> this is probably gonna be the whole video. Just doing the car smash record. There's a lot of cars throughout the city. Okay, that one usually messes me up. Guys, we need a lot of balloons. Um, Should we go for that one down there? I think so. Let's go for it, we can't go too slow. We need it to explode still, yes! Guys, this is very good. Okay, hit that car, dude. I lost count. Um, I haven't really been <laughs> counting. You guys let me know in the comments. Well, we get, dude, this is this is gonna be a new record. Okay, I knew we could do it. I knew we could do it. Let's hit the punchy mobile. No. Okay, hit the punchy mobile, then we'll get this blue one, then we'll get that van, then we'll get the red car. Guys, we're gonna get every car in the city. Oh no! Oh, that was a really bad bounce. Okay, I know this is kind of like cheating and stuff, but dude, I've tried it before. And it's still really tough to get these, even with the balloon jetpack. Dude, we're gonna do this. The whole goal is just not to touch the ground. And, well yeah, it's like the floor is lava kind of thing. Okay, get this car. I know there's one over here too. Dude, we need a lot of balloons. <laughs> we got this one. I don't know where the next one is. Yes, that was good. I think the next one's over here. <laughs> guys, guys, we're almost, oh no, we're almost five minutes into it. I can't destroy the, the Coca-Cola vehicle. Dude, I don't even know where the next one is. Um, <laughs> well, we're still in the air. There's one over there. Here's a car over here. And where would the next one be? There's a pink car in that lot. Guys, whoa! Okay, that doesn't count. <laughs> that doesn't count, it starts on the ground. Guys, I think we already broke the record. You guys gotta let me know in the comments how many cars we've uh, destroyed so far. <laughs> this is, I don't know, like I said, you might consider this cheating. But hey, we gotta do what we gotta do to break the record. I know we've destroyed the record so far. I don't even know where I, we, we've gotta be close to like 20 or something. Uh, maybe 21, I don't know. That was a really good bounce. Okay, and I know there's a bus over here, guys. We're gonna get every single vehicle in the city. You know, this, is, this isn't this is what I was planning on doing the whole video. <laughs> I'm sure it's taking a lot of time. Okay, keep it going. We got a car. I know there's a car around here. Here it is. There's a green car, and then there's a car on the other side of these buildings. Guys, we're gonna get like everyone in the city. I'm serious. What a, that was a bad bounce. I bounced off that building, but we're still up. We're still up. Keep it going. Just don't touch the ground. The floor is lava. Are there any cars on the buildings? I don't think so. Dude, is this the last one? 
I can't remember any other cars around here. This might be the last one. Guys, this might be a, a world record. Somebody call Guinness. Somebody call Guinness for a world Oh, no. There's one on that. There's one on that roof. But someone, please somebody call Guinness for a world record. I'll, I'll sign the papers and I will accept the, re the reward. I will be in the book and I'll get a plaque and I'll have my picture in the newspaper. <laughs> and there's another car right there. And it'll just be good, you know? Because I'm in the Guinness Book of World Records for hitting the most amount of cars in Amazing Frog without touching the ground. Dude, I think that's all the cars. I think that's all the cars in the city. I know there's one outside the city, too. Guys, do you see any cars? I think we got... Oh, there's a blue one right there. I almost forgot about that one. Guys, after the... Oh, right. There are a bunch in the garage. Okay, that might just be impossible. Dude, to get all the cars inside the garage, that'd just be impossible. Okay, so where's the last car? I know there's like, there's like, uh, there it is. There's a merry-go-round and a car here. <laughs> Guys, I don't know, man. This might have to be our whole video. We're gonna get this one, and then we're gonna get every single car in the parking garage. Although, yeah, like I said, that might be impossible. But we gotta try it. We gotta try it. Okay, I think we've gotten every car. Um, somebody called Guinness, like I said. I will accept all the rewards. I will accept plaques. I will accept trophies. And my name in the newspaper. And don't touch the ground. Don't touch the ground. Oh, that was close. That was close. That was very close. We're going back up. And bring her back down. <laughs> okay, this is gonna be tough. Are there any more cars that I'm missing? I bet you guys see one. That I'm totally missing. Something about when you're recording, you have a tendency of like missing things. Okay, I know I could have gotten like the tractor or something. No! Okay, well, there it goes. Well, guys, <laughs> the main goal for today is getting this Megalodon up against the red Megalodon, and I just realized I missed that fan. How did I miss that fan? We used that last video. Okay, it doesn't matter. Okay, um, also, the whole like driving the RC car up into the toilet. Maybe we'll save that for another video. Guys, we're already kind of running low on time. We gotta get going now. So, here's the plan. Here's the plan. I got an idea, actually. So, we're gonna get the regular Megalodon first, bring it to the city, and then, oh, we actually need the giant tank. So, here's the plan. I'm gonna put the regular Megalodon up against the red Megalodon, and I'm gonna put the giant tank in between them. I'll be in between them. They're gonna be, like, going for me, but one of them is gonna get the tank, and their mouths, maybe both of them will. And I'll shoot it, we'll see which one explodes. Maybe they both will. I really don't know. But I also wanna try something. I wanna try, I wanna see how long, I wanna time how long it takes to get the blimp um, with the Megalodon to the city compared to, I have another method to try to bring the red Megalodon to the city. I don't know if it's gonna work. My idea is I wanna grapple it and then launch it with the grapple hook I think that might bring it to the city faster, but we'll just have to see. Okay, guys, goal is we gotta get this blimp. We'll get the blimp. We'll get the giant fire tank. We'll get the Megalodon. We're gonna bring it to the city. This is not gonna be, this is not gonna be easy. Okay, guys, we got the blimp, and we gotta be careful. <laughs> we gotta be careful with this balloon jetpack. If I pop a balloon in this thing, it's gonna explode the whole thing and ruin everything. How many times can I say thing in one uh, in one sentence? Okay, I think I said it like five times. <laughs> okay, so guys, we're in the blimp, and here we go, here we go. So last time, last time I was pretty nervous because thing is, if one thing goes wrong, we gotta start all over, which takes a very long time. So <laughs> there's a lot more that could go wrong this time. I'm hoping things go smoothly. So guys, maybe you can help out. If we can get this video to 10,000 likes, I think that's gonna help. I think that's gonna help our chances to get everything to go smoothly and get it all to work. So yeah, guys, 10,000 likes, and if everything goes smoothly, I'm giving you guys the credit. Okay, uh, we gotta land on this island. This went well last time. So we got a little practice. The only thing is, once I get it, is this the right move? I think this is the right move. We get the tank first, and then the Megalodon. Hopefully, he doesn't like suction it into his mouth like instantly. Okay, so we'll get this tank, then we'll get the Megalodon, 
We'll bring it to the city, and then we'll try to get the red one. Guys, <laughs> this is probably gonna take a while. Okay, bring her down nice and slow. Guys, I'm getting deja vu from last video, and actually, um, I'm recording this the same day as the last video. So this is nice and fresh. Okay, you know what? Um, you know what would have been embarrassing? That's, that's okay. Um, that's not great. <laughs> it would have been embarrassing if, okay, let's drop it. It would have been embarrassing if like I forgot the grapple hook. That would have been really bad. Okay, well good news is we didn't. Why is my, why did I go head first? Okay, guys, um, first part of the plan is working. Wait, why can't I go in? Why can't I go in? Um, yes. Okay, that was weird. It's like there was an invisible wall or something. Okay, I can't be dealing with invisible walls right now. Okay, so now we get the Megalodon. Where is that guy? Where's the buoy? I th oh, there it is. Okay, we're gonna get the reg regular Megalodon. And actually, <laughs> dude, actually, I gotta bring him all the way to shore. I gotta bring him to shore and then attach him. That kinda stinks. Okay, guys, we're getting close. As soon as that buoy goes down, Megalodon is active and I can't allow him to grab the blimp or to grab the tank or anything. We just gotta get close enough for him to get his attention and bring him to swimming on sea. Oh no! Okay, uh, <laughs> we can't have the blimp flipping over either. Okay, dude, I see him! I see him, he's jumping out, he almost, <laughs> dude, he almost got me. Okay, let's bring him to swimming on sea. I think I'm high enough to where he can't get me, but just low enough that we got his attention. Guys, this is perfect. Dude, look at this view. Look at that view we got. Okay, um, he's definitely gonna be faster than me going backwards. The, and the reason I'm going backwards is because if I go forwards, anytime I'm carrying anything, if I go forwards, I just flip over and the blimp explodes. So we gotta go backwards. Okay, guys, we made it to shore. Megalodon is here. He's probably gonna grab a snack. <laughs> he got frogs all over the place. He's probably gonna grab a snack. But what we gotta do is attach him to this blimp. And that shouldn't be too bad, hopefully. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I think we've tried this before and it's not very easy. So hopefully everything goes according to plan. Hopefully we got to 10,000 likes because that's the only way for us to get this to work. <laughs> okay. So guys, here we go. Here we go. Bring her down. Perfect. And get out of here. And guys, let's just get this Megalodon. Let's just do this. First try. He is kind of far. Why is he so far? Why is the blimp moving so fast? That's not good. Okay, I can't have the blimp moving fast like that. Okay, Megalodon and blimp. Oh no. Oh, there goes the blimp. Bye bye blimp. Oh no. Okay, um, you know what we gotta do now? Uh, <laughs> I think we gotta bring the blimp back here without exploding it. Okay, how about like this? That's working. That's working without exploding. I love when things work without exploding. Okay and jump in here. This is probably gonna be very difficult. No! Yeah, I knew that. I knew this was gonna happen. The propeller's gonna suck me in. <laughs> Guys, this is gonna be tough. Okay, hopefully, hopefully I can bring it back a little further and bring it back without exploding. It's working without exploding, I think. That's good. Okay, let's try this again. Try this again. Okay, the propeller's trying to, uh-oh, it's flipping a little. <laughs> flipping just a little bit. Propeller is sucking me in. Well, that's not good. Oh no. Okay, blimp is, why is the blimp going like that? Oh, it's cause the, it's cause the Megalodon. Okay, yeah, this is gonna be very challenging. Guys, I'm in, I'm in the blimp. Oh no, I jumped out the window. <laughs> I jumped out the window. That's not good. <laughs> okay, oh, oh, blimp is moving again. That's interesting. Oh no, there goes the blimp. No, blimp, don't do it. Don't do it, Blimp. Oh my goodness, dude, we flipped it back. Okay, so I like, oh no. Blimp, don't do it. No, don't do it, don't explode. Oh my goodness, guys. Okay, I can't let this Blimp explode, dude. We gotta get this thing back over. Okay. <laughs> the thing, it just wants to explode. Okay, we gotta back up. Uh-oh. Okay, now it's going this way. It's on my head. And there we go. Now it's flipping this way. Okay, Um, I think it's okay. <laughs> I think the blimp's okay right now. So here's the plan. I gotta change where the Megalodon is. I think that's what our problem was. This is, <laughs> this is so tough. Okay, just stay there. Okay, we need a new position for the Megalodon and I guess that's it. No, no, don't flip. Did that explode the, um, the tank? 
that exploded the tank. Guys, um, things aren't going according to plan. I assume we didn't get the 10,000 likes. Oh, there's the tank. Um, problem is we still need another blimp. Okay, uh, let's try that again. Okay, I got an idea. Oh, I'm landing on that frog. <laughs> I have an idea. So, hmm. Hopefully this works, dude. This isn't gonna work. I don't know, guys, this is tough. This was my idea. I was thinking if I grapple the Megalodon to the front of the blimp, it won't push the blimp off to the side, but I think that's just gonna drag it off the cliff. Is it just gonna drag it off the cliff? Oh boy. Oh boy. <laughs> this could be bad. Okay, let's go line. Oh no! That wasn't good. That wasn't good at all. I'm trapped. I'm trapped underneath the Megalodon and I'm stuck in the blimp. <laughs> Okay, okay, dude, and I can't lose that tank. Okay, let's try this again. Wait, where, oh, there it is. I grappled myself. Guys, I grappled myself. Um, this is not, <laughs> this is not good. What's happening? Guys, I grappled myself. It's going through my body, and it's going all around, and my arm is bending backwards. Okay, well, that's good. <laughs> okay, so we got that fixed. Megalodon. Okay, why do I have like one second to get this thing? Okay, we got a, Dude, we gotta get this guy. Okay, I grappled myself again. I grappled my leg. <laughs> I grappled my leg this time. Okay, guys, let's just do this. Focus, focus. Megalodon, blimp. Uh-oh, too far, too far. Okay, let's try it a little closer. Megalodon, blimp. Blimp, blimp, blimp. Oh, maybe I can't do it on the, oh no. Maybe I can't do it on the, that part of the blimp. That's weird. Why can't I move? I can't move. <laughs> this is not going according to plan at all. Guys, I need your help. I need more likes. I think that's the only reason why this isn't working. Okay, here we go. That's not inside the cockpit, is it? Hopefully not. <laughs> this is not going according to plan at all. Okay, let's just move this up here. And that's good. And then attach it to the blimp. Dude, where's it going? Where's it going? I guess it's way up there now. He's still attached, that's good. Okay, and guys, this is gonna be, this is gonna be a little tough. I can't even turn fast enough. <laughs> guys, this is really tough. Okay, okay, no. I didn't grab it myself that time, that's good. And we'll just get it to the back. Okay, all I gotta do now is get in the blimp. Is he still, what's wrong with that guy? Uh-oh, blimp is flipping. Blimp is flipping again. Why is the blimp flipping? Please stop flipping. No. Oh my goodness, we just saved it. We just saved it. Okay, don't flip. Is he still attached? I don't even know. Guys, let's just go for it. The blimp's probably gonna flip again. Please give me in the blimp. Uh-oh, and it's flipping again. Uh-oh, now it's flipping this way. Dude, it's somehow still alive. Come on, blimp. Come on. You know what, I just need to, I just need to get it. No, I need to get it stable on both sides. Dude, I need to just lock it down. Okay, it's locked down. Now it can't flip anywhere. Okay, the only problem is, dude, if we let go of any of these ropes, we're done for. Okay, give me the blimp, and let's see if this shark is still attached. Okay, can I fly? I don't think I can fly this thing. Okay, here's the plan. Release all the things. Fly. Oh no, oh no, oh no, please fly. Please fly, and go up, and please tell me the Megalodon is going with us. Oh, we still have one more, uh-oh. We still have one more thing. Um, I can't, okay, yes, and fly blimp, please fly blimp, please fly blimp, yes, fly blimp, yes, okay, here we go, please tell me he's attached, is he attached, he's not attached, um, I see the grapple hook thing, the grapple is there, um, but he's not attached for some reason, that's bad, okay, he's definitely grappled this time, and the blimp isn't flipping, it's not flipping yet, um, is he grappled still? It looks glitched again. Let's just grapple again, him again for good measure. Give me in this blimp before it flips. Oh no, not a balloon. Give me the blimp. Guys, we're in. Guys, we're in. And fly, and fly. Fly up with the Megalodon and the tank isn't attached anymore. Guys, why? Why? Bring her down, it's okay. You know, bring her down. There's a bunch of frogs watching for some reason. There's a million frogs right here in this spot. I don't know why, but uh, hey, you know, everything's going according to plan. Not really, but uh, all I gotta do is get this tank on the blimp, and we're good to go. Let's go. Let's go. What just happened? Megalodon went flying. Why did he go flying? Get in the blimp. 
and he's down there again. Okay, um, this is going very bad. <laughs> uh, well, now we got the tank, but no Megalodon. Can we just do one at a time? No, we've done this before. Oh my goodness, guys. I just jumped out of the blimp because the tank wasn't attached. Now it's attached. It's attached to midair. What is happening? Okay, is the blimp gonna come down? Okay, the blimp always comes down and now it's not coming down. Okay, guys, here's the new plan. I'm just gonna bring the red Megalodon here. Oh my goodness, this is gonna, <laughs> this is gonna take forever. I've been recording for 45 minutes. And this is probably gonna take a very long time to bring this guy. Okay, you know what? Maybe the red megalodon will leave me alone if I'm wearing the red shark head. You think? I don't know, it's a long shot. Okay, as soon as we hit this buoy, he's gonna he's gonna spawn in. You know, maybe we can see him as soon as he spawns. That would actually be pretty cool. Okay, I think he comes from this area. Where is he? Uh, there's regular sharks. Uh-oh, oh, there he is! Okay, guys, we gotta just go. <laughs> we gotta just go for it. And wow, I'm flying and I can't pop the balloons. That's good. Uh, I don't know why. <laughs> I don't know why that happens. But sometimes, wow. Dude, was he flying? Sometimes I can't pop balloons. And now they're popping. Okay, so here's the plan. I bring him to shore and I just grapple him over and over and over. And we gotta go all the way out there. <laughs> this is gonna be tough. Like, honestly, it's probably gonna be faster than the blimp method though. He's living, he's very hungry which is understandable. You know, uh, he's probably, probably doesn't have a lot of food and he probably really likes frog legs. Okay, I got his attention. Let's bring him over to shore. Guys, I think this is gonna work. All we gotta do is bring him to shore and I'm actually able to pop the balloons now, which is good. As long as he doesn't eat me alive, I think we're gonna be okay. So here's the plan. I grapple him onto shore and then hopefully I can launch him. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I've never really tried this before. Let's just see what happens. Okay, that kind of works. He's very heavy. I guess I should have known that. He's very heavy, but once I get him over this ridge, that should be good, right? I don't know, it's not like super fast, but once we get over the ridge, maybe, maybe we can get some momentum going. Okay guys, we made it over the ridge. Hopefully we can get some momentum. Dude, he's going down the hill. We're still really far away. Um, I've been going at this for about 10 minutes. But dude, look at that momentum. Okay, let's use this. Use this momentum. And can we launch him? Okay, that maybe launched him a little. <laughs> Not that much. But at least we're going downhill. Dude, look at how far we gotta go. Guys, I've been recording for an hour. Um, yeah, please leave a like. <laughs> please leave a like if you like this video. Oh my goodness, I can't believe this is actually working. It's kind of working. <laughs> it's definitely glitching a lot. Dude. I've been, I've been doing this for like, I don't know, 20, 30 minutes? I didn't really get that far, and I was like, well, what if <laughs> what if I started using balloons? Dude, we're getting this guy up in midair. Um, are we traveling? I think we're traveling, it's very slow. I don't know what's faster. <laughs> I don't know, maybe if we get high enough, then we can drag him down kind of fast. So yeah, maybe this will work. I don't know, guys, this is, I've been recording for over an hour at this point. Um, so yeah. I just gotta make this work. I'm gonna do whatever it takes to make this match happen. Uh-oh, we're kinda losing him. Is he going down? Okay, I think he's coming back up. I think this is okay. Uh, just popping some balloons, and we gotta go to where those green sparkling things are. That's the buoys. Oh my goodness, guys. Please tell me this is gonna work. Okay, guys, new plan. Hopefully this one works. Okay, I'm just gonna drive him. I'm gonna drive him to Swinton on sea. Okay, um, is that working? Not really. <laughs> I thought I'd be able to push him. Guys, this is really, really difficult. Dude, how come transporting these guys is so tough? I just drive right under him. Okay, maybe, do you think I could grapple him to the van and then maybe the van could drag him? Okay, let's just try it. Let's see what happens. Grapple him to the van and let's do it. Guys, let's drive. Let's drive. Okay, let's drive. Are we driving? No. Now we're driving. Now we're driving. Here we go. Next stop, Swindon on Sea. Next stop is uh, Swindon on Sea. Okay, well, let's just go this way first. You know, we can go this way first. And we'll turn around. Next stop, Swindon on Sea. Here we go. Okay, we're taking the long route. And here we go. Now it's going perfectly. You know what, I gotta say, I kinda like this method. This might be my new favorite method for transporting things. 
This might even be faster than the blimp, honestly. Okay, I'm only at 75 minutes of recording. This is perfect. And uh, yeah, here we go. Oh my goodness, guys, we're almost there. Dude, there's the blimp right there. It hasn't moved. We're actually gonna have to explode that blimp, which is fine. Dude, the blimp is there. I see, uh-oh, why are we stuck? Oh, here we go. <laughs> um, the blimp is there. We're gonna have to explode it. I see the tank. I don't see the Megalodon, though. That could be a problem um, because he's very critical to this plan. <laughs> okay, now we're going downhill. Dude, things might get a little dicey now. Okay, we're going downhill. Everything's going according to plan so far. Okay, where's the Megalodon? Please tell me he's still there. You know what, sometimes the Megalodon takes a little bit to, there he is. Oh my goodness, dude, he's like inside the blimp. Okay, yeah, sometimes it takes a little bit for them to render. Dude, this is gonna happen. This battle is gonna happen, so this is what we need to do. I need to unattach the Megalodon and the tank. Just let him go on the ground. Dude, is he flying? <laughs> we're, gonna have to, we're gonna have to unattach those things and just set the tank in a, in a central position so the Megalodon and the red Megalodon both have an equal chance and we're gonna have a battle. Okay, maybe we could have them on this road. I don't know, guys. I'm at, uh-oh, uh-oh. Can I get him on this road? Dude, he's pulling me down. He's pulling me down. He's so heavy. Okay, that might not work. Um, let's just, <laughs> let's just let him do his thing. Okay, so I let him go. Let's see if I can get him up on this road. Dude, it's working. He's almost up on the road, and get him here. Okay, I think that'd be a, uh-oh. <laughs> I think that'd be a nice place for him. Okay, so we got the red Megalodon. Um, let's put him, uh-oh, <laughs> let's put him right there. And then, dude, everything is working. Please tell me, please tell me we can actually get a decent battle here. Okay, so now we gotta unattach all that stuff. Okay, please don't explode by falling. That's good, <laughs> it didn't explode. That's very good. It is gonna, uh-oh, it is kinda going down that hill. Okay, that's good, we saved it. Let's bring this guy up the hill, onto the road, and guys, we're gonna be good to go. Okay, um, let's just do it one little step at a time. We'll get him right here. That's good. And then, dude, actually with the red Megalodon, I got some practice. So that practice was actually good. Okay, let's see if I can get him over here. Dude, that's really good. He's almost over there. Okay, guys, this is going really well. And then get this tank over there. Okay, we're so close. Just put him, put him in a central location. Okay, guys, I think this is gonna work. I hope it's gonna work. Although they are kind of at a slope, but I think, okay, do these guys chase me? Do they chase me if they're free? Okay, is this guy chasing me? That's the thing. Okay, I'm right next to him. I can't get sucked in though. I'm right, right next to him. Okay, it doesn't look like they chase me. You know what? I think we gotta do this in the water. That's what we gotta do. Okay, I'll put the tank in the water and then I'll put both of them in there and whichever one bites at first, they lose. Whoever explodes loses. Okay, that guy's getting launched. Yeah, I think if they're in the water, then they can move. We need some freedom with these guys. Okay, so he's in there and we'll launch this guy in there. I think this is gonna work, <laughs> hopefully it does. Okay, now we got this tank. We'll just put the tank down there. Oh, dude, that guy's not in the water yet. We gotta get these guys like in the water. Okay, get out there, that's perfect. Okay, he's gonna, he's gonna be in the water. And, dude, we just gotta roll this thing down there, and whichever one bites it first gets exploded. Okay, and does this thing float? I actually forgot. That would actually be really nice if it floated. Okay, let's just try it. <laughs> let's put it in the water, because if it floats, then they can really swim around a lot. Okay, um, put it in the water. We're right in the middle of both of them. Dude, something might happen right here. Okay, we're putting it in the water, and let's just see what happens. We're right in the middle of both of them. Who's gonna attack first? Um, neither of them so far, and it does float. That's really good. Oh no! I forgot about sharks. Um, actually, <laughs> that's not good. Okay, yeah, sharks are bad, but the good news is if they bite, or no! If they bite my balloons! <laughs> I was gonna say, if they bite my balloons, then it explodes them, which is very nice. That's very good. Okay, so guys, I don't know if you can see it, but I got the red tank. I had to drag it out with a jet ski. So here's what we do. We get the Megalodon's attention, and the red Megalodon's attention, we gotta get him swimming, and whichever one goes for it first, obviously, I keep saying that, I keep saying it. You guys know how it's gonna go. Okay, let's see if we can get some of these guys' attention. It's just like, they're so docile when they get close to the shore. 
Okay, guys, I got both of these guys chasing me. We got the red megalodon, we got the gray megalodon, and we got a bunch of sharks. You can't see them all, <laughs> but they're there. Okay, there's the sharks. There's the regular megalodon. There's the red megalodon, guys. All we gotta do now is lure them, <laughs> lure them into this big red tank. Uh-oh, without, oh no, without getting eaten. No! Oh, that's not good. That's not good. This is very bad. Um, Apollon's fart. Oh boy. This is, uh, very bad. Okay. Um, yeah, this is, <laughs> guys, this is, this is the hardest Amazing Frog video I've ever recorded. I'm pretty sure. I can't imagine a video that's been harder than this one. Okay, all I gotta do is just get these guys' attention. There's all the balloons for me. Okay, all I gotta do is get these guys' attention and lure them into this red tank. Dude, we're over 100 minutes of recording. Yeah, this is, de this is definitely the hardest one I've ever done. Okay, if you never left a like on a video, please do it in today's video. Okay, um, we just need him to, we just need him to hit this red tank. You know, oh dude, look at this. The red one's closer, but the gray one's moving in fast. Oh my goodness. Guys, this is really close. Which one's gonna grab it? Which one's gonna grab it? I think it's the red one. Guys, the red one got it. Okay, well, let's uh, let's explode it. Actually, dude, they might be sharing it. Okay, let's get a gun. Dude, this is, that was actually really close. I feel like that was a pretty fair match. Um, so let's get a gun. <laughs> and, dude, my prediction might be right. Wait, we don't even got any guns. We gotta turn on the guns. My prediction might be right. I don't know, guys. Let's just see what happens. What do we got? The, not the Nerf gun. <laughs> I need a real gun. <laughs> Give me like a regular AK-47. Frog Zapper will work. Okay, dude. Let's just explode this tank, and we'll see who wins. Okay, guys. That actually looks really close. Let's just see what happens. Will one of them explode? Three, two, one. Dude, the gray one won it. The red megalodon, he fell for the oldest trick in the book. <laughs> Okay, why am I putting this lifesaver on? Okay, get that off. I can't get it off. Okay, well, that's on forever now. <laughs> okay, Okay. well, congratulations, Gray, regular Megalodon. You won. You're the king. You're the king of the ocean. But, guys, here's what I'm thinking. I know the Gray, the original Megalodon, won the first match. But I'm thinking maybe we could even think of some more competitions. So guys, if you have any ideas for any competitions with the Megalodon and the Red Megalodon, let me know in the comments. But, guys, this was a lot of fun. And if you missed last video, it was our first time taking out the Red Megalodon. Hey guys, definitely check out my Tasty Blues series if you haven't. It's a really fun game. I know it's not like a brand new game, but it's new to me. I love it, and I think you guys are gonna love it too. But guys, I really hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, as always, feel free to hit that thumbs up button and subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you guys in the next Amazing Frog. Please tell me I can grab him. Whoa! Okay, so let's hit the airlock. Is this some kind of simulator? Oh my goodness. Oh, dude, it's a sandworm. Oh, he's got me. You gotta be kidding me. Keep shooting. No, he got me.